going on everybody? Good morning. So today, Elwyn and I and a guest that we have staying at our house right now are traveling through Rocky Mountain National Forest. We're going to go up over Trail Ridge Road, check out Grand Lake, and then uh, really just go on a big road trip today. Anyway, thank you guys so much for coming along this journey with us and uh, I hope you enjoy. I worked for Best Buy. We just went through Estes Park and now we are headed up through Rocky Mountain National Forest. Where are we going? Up over what pass? Old River Road? Uh, Old River? Yeah, we're here now. And okay. then we are going into this gravel road, I mean unpaved road. And there are a few trails out here. And this is uh, the, uh, the, one of the uh, highest peak in this area. I mean this uh, national park. So, so this is a small trail over here. Very cool. It's so cool coming here with tourists because they know more about this area than I do. <laughs> and I've lived here my entire life. So uh, we're going to go check out some new things today. So I hope you guys enjoy. Elwin, what's the most insane off-roading you've ever done? Um, well, I hit a, like a pretty few gnarly potholes one time. <laughs> <laughs> So I jumped pretty good, <laughs> but other than that, nothing too crazy. <laughs> You're looking good so far, though. I think uh, we're doing some pretty decent off-roading right now. Yeah, no, this is uh, right. I mean, yeah. I mean, it's not. It's still like a, a groomed road, yeah. so it's not really off-roading. There's just a lot of potholes, so we're kind of bouncing around a little bit. <laughs> yeah, like I said, we're not gonna have to climb any rocks or anything like that. We could climb this rock right there though if we wanted. Right? Yeah, Not could... next to this cliff though, that'd yeah. be dangerous. Yeah. Holy cow! This is quite the drop off right here. I was too busy taking pictures and had no idea that we were stopping. <laughs> What's down here? Going to a waterfall, nice. Dude, look how touristy I am. Got my camera. You're a tourist. I am a I'm a tourist in my own land, man. This is so cool. Look how amazing this waterfall is. What do you think, Mr. Mountain Climber? Do I think it's pretty cool. Yeah, I enjoy it. <laughs> Quality assessment from Mountaineer Ranger <laughs> Elwyn Holderfield. What y'all trying to do? She just wants to get a photo down there. And I'll be up here. Taking the photo. <laughs> Can you should pose for her photo. So like pose oh. while you're taking the photo. Do you smile for her photo? <laughs> <laughs> say cheese and you are the one who smiles. Let's run down there real quick and say hey. <laughs> I didn't bring my swimsuit. Oh, yeah. Next time. Next time we come back, I'm going swimming, guys. Waterfall check. Where we're off to next, no one knows. Only the road knows. I feel like at every turn, I'm just gonna wanna pull out my camera because look at these views. And I know it's gonna be like this the whole way, so I, I apologize ahead of time. Ah! <laughs> yeah, all over my face. <laughs> Uh, dude, I'm covered in mud. <laughs> Your nature dude is something. Get a little mud on the cars. Oh my gosh. No. Right on, dude. Congrats. Someday I want to do that. That just inspired me. That just inspired me to do something incredible. I think in order for me to be able to ride a bicycle up here, I need to uh, start injecting steroids or something crazy. <laughs> I just need to amp it up right away, man. I'm not waiting around to build up that kind of that kind of muscle uh, mass. Yeah. Let's be realistic. I could do it. It just might take me a week to do it. <laughs> One mile a day, baby. And I've got a road bike. That's the other problem. I need uh, to find myself a mountain bike. Here's the starting line right here. Ready, yes. set, go! go. Uh, and uh, one day later, he's only gone a mile. <laughs> this doesn't reach the summit. No, we'll get there.
So we're pretty much a tree line coming up on the top of this pass. Um, yeah. Can you imagine being the first, uh, like the uh, Native Americans traveling through this region, finding this area? They'd be like, "I've found, like I've, I've found heaven. Like this yeah. is. There's nothing more beautiful than this." In your moccasins and buffalo coat, <laughs> horse-drawn carriages. Right. One, two, three, it's the boat. Snoop Doggy Dog and Dr. Drake is the Dude, uh, Elwin, I think. I think you're gonna need a car wash when you get home. Nah, you will be good. Gives it character. There you go. <laughs> gonna go hiking. This chilly wind is certainly one way to experience winter in the middle of August. <laughs> this is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Wind's gonna knock me over. Woo! <laughs> Feel like I can fly. This is so cool, man. I've never been to the top here before, and this is one of the coolest things I've done this summer. This is absolutely amazing. All right, I'm gonna get down. We're up here at about 11,500 feet. 11,400 probably, um, which is right about the tree line here in Colorado. There's a couple small uh, bushes and shrubs that grow higher than 11,400, but yeah, this is, um, this is about all you get as far as vegetation is concerned. Other than that, you just get natural beauty in every other form, man. This is unbelievable. Wind's Stepping all over, over each other. What do you think, dude? I don't like it. Yeah? You know it'd be really funny. What? If we brought a fishing pole and tried to fish out of that <laughs> lake, people around here would be like, "Dude, <laughs> you know there's no fish in there." Cool. Feeling good. good. Um, All next right. leg, we're gonna be at the very top over there. Going to the top. Cool. I think we're ready to go to the top. Ready to go hiking. That's Trail Ridge Road. Trail Ridge Road is the road, I believe it's the highest road in the, highest road or highest highway in the country, which is pretty cool. Maximum elevation of 12,100 feet, something like that. I think we're about to hike to about 12,000 feet. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> Let's do it. In the words of Elwin, <laughs> master mountaineer, rock climber Elvin. Elwin, God, I'll never get those names right. Let's do it. Let's Dewey. Elwin was very meticulous this morning in choosing proper mountain climbing attire. Those things have any grip? No, they're all. <laughs> it's okay, man. You're rocking some serious style points right now. These steps are just awkwardly spaced so that you can take one giant step each time or two. <laughs> and with the High elevation, you get out of breath a little easier. We have reached the top. How does it feel? Good. Twelve five. Doing the stairs, I was like. Yeah, like imagine taking the deepest breath you can, like, and it there's just, it's like, you can feel your lungs inflating and your sternum, like, yeah. pulling down, but there's no air in there, like, there's nothing, when they say the air is thin up here, they're not lying, they're not lying, give me a pose, give me like, yeah, dude, give me like a mafia, give me like, you know, a, uh, what a, <laughs> Headed back down. Ah, a moment of silence with oh, no yeah. wind. That's nice. Oh, that's nice. Very nice. I 
I think that man is crazy. Running up the stairs, no way. So we stopped for some coffee and some drinks. Or, um, I don't know, what'd you get? Um, mocha latte, whipped cream, venti. Venti, I see, that, that to me sounds large. Maybe it is. Is venti large? I don't know. Or what's grande? Is that this size? Yeah. We got that size. But yeah, we stopped for some coffee to kind of warm up a little bit. And we will be back on the road here pretty soon. I think the rest of the trip's just gonna be mostly driving and seeing some cool things. We're gonna be going through Grand Lake, Granby, oh, yeah, Winter we'll stop, Park. We'll stop at Grand Lake though for We'll stop at Grand Lake. Maybe eat yep. there or something. Oh and we gotta get some food too. Go down uh, Loveland. Oh no, this is the perfect this way. What else do we see on I-7? We'll see uh, Loveland Ski Area. Winter Park. Georgetown, Idaho Springs, yeah. Evergreen. Then the big stinky we call Denver. That's water. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I, even with a lot of sulfur, it's not like that. <laughs> so I, I got a water cup, but I figured I should benefit from some sugar and some caffeine. I'll get, I'll get water after this. Oh, it's like Mountain Dew, pretty oh. much. It's called Mellow Yellow. It's like, it, like Mountain... It's a rip-off Mountain Dew, basically. Uh, well, it's not really, I mean, it's water. Yeah, it's not, it doesn't really very, uh, look very healthy, so... What do you think? Nature Dew, whatever. Oh, gosh. Is there any elk or anything out here? You have to untangle this rat's nest. <sighs> hey man, thanks for driving. Oh yeah, dude, my pleasure. We made a pit stop. Man. Someday I'll own one. Hey, Owen. Yeah. We're, uh, we're tourists on our own territory right mm -hmm. now. Do you realize that? Yeah, I know. But, <laughs> but it's funny because we're all this nature and then we're, everyone's taking pictures of this car. <laughs> dude, that was the first stop I made. <laughs> Instead of coming over here, I was like, dude, hold on. We oh, got to check out this car. Check out this car. <laughs> it's a pretty this sweet car. Yeah. Someday I'll own one. But we are standing in the most, uh, well, we've got, we a, got a tree. We've got a tree. we got to move. We don't have to, but we want to. Oh yeah. Everybody got all their pictures out of the way, all their everything, everybody happy? Dude, every time I get in and out of this thing, I have to face certain destruction of my pants. Uh, I just woke up from a little nap and we are now in Grand Lake. <laughs> you were napping back there? I was taking a little nap, yeah. I mean that politics discussion was so interesting and all, but <laughs> <laughs> I fell asleep, so I wasn't more engaged. <laughs> is it just me or does this town seem really quiet? It just seems like a calm, peaceful, quiet town. Yeah, it's kind of nice. I want to say hi to the camera. Hola. Okay, so we're getting out of here, going to Granby. Go get some food in Granby, I think. Is that the plan? Yeah. Get some food? Yeah. Find a good home food restaurant. So far, uh, Google has suggested Subway <laughs> and, and American Chinese food. So. Oh, and McDonald's. Oh, McDonald's. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we're going to really hope to try to uh, wean, wean those off and find something real tasty. Being in the back seat, I just keep going from one end to the other, just yeah. getting photos and videos. <laughs> I'm just sliding back and forth. Again, riding in Elwyn's Jeep with no seatbelt. Yeah, but I have the doors on. But at least this time he has the doors on. Oh, you know what I forgot? I forgot my Speedo. Oh. We don't need Speedos, we can just go skinny dipping, huh? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Maverick's Grill, I don't think we can go wrong here. I think we found a winner. We're gonna go get some food.
<laughs> Dude, we made it. <laughs> Ooh, so cramped up, man. That last little stretch from Berthet Pass to Greeley was rough. But this guy did it. Thank you so much for being our driver. Really appreciate it. That was a really bad high five. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for coming along this one with me. I hope you guys enjoyed. And until next time, we'll see you later.